The hot wire is a quick test to measure the quenching speed of an oil. It correlates well with the quenching uh, performance of the oil. However, it's not applicable to the water-based quenchants. Uh, quenching of an oil means uh, heating it to a higher temperature and then uh, cooling it abruptly to a lower one. In the hot wire uh, testing, uh, the steel, the wire, is uh, heated from room temperature to a higher temperature by passing an increasingly electric current through it. The heat generated in the wire is uh, continuously taken away by the oil until a point is reached when the generated heat is more than that's taken away by the oil. Uh, at that point the wire fuses and uh, that's what we call the hot wire reading. The equipment necessary uh, to run this test is the hot wire apparatus the wire holding probe, uh, it's a, a thermometer, a hot plate and a beaker and of course the oils. Before testing an oil sample we need to calibrate the apparatus. We are going to use an accelerated calibration oil as a reference. How we do it? We pour 150 ml of uh, the accelerated calibration oil in a beaker and uh, heated it up on the hot plate uh, to 140 degrees Fahrenheit. Then uh, we place uh, the wire between the electrodes of the probe. and put the probe in the oil. The switch uh, of the apparatus is turned on and uh, as we are seeing here uh, the current keeps on increasing until the wire fuses. This maximum current that the wire can take before burning out is uh, locked on the display and uh, it's taken at the hot wire reading. Three such a determinations are taken and the average value is uh, considered to be the quench speed of the oil. For the calibration oil uh, the value that we are expecting is 34 plus minus 0 0.2 amps. If uh, that's not the case uh, the apparatus has a calibration knob here that can be adjusted and the test is repeated again uh, until uh, the value falls within the spec. Now that the apparatus is calibrated, we are gonna take our oil sample, which is unused AAA oil, and uh, repeat the procedure. Take three readings of the hot wire and do the average. First, we are gonna heat it up to 140 degrees Fahrenheit and then we are going to run the test. We follow certain guidelines uh, in reporting uh, if the hot wire of an oil is satisfactory or not. In the case of a used AAA oil, the hot wire is considered satisfactory if it's uh, at least 30 amps. If that's not the case, uh, which is uh, our oil too, uh, then um, the speed quench of the oil is considered to be low. The quench speed of the oil can be boosted up by adding accelerator to it, uh, which is added usually at the 5% level. I have here 7.5 ml of the quench oil accelerator that's going to be uh, going into the sample. And 
then uh, the test is repeated. Three readings uh, are taken and the average is recorded as the hot wire of the oil. Usually adding 5% accelerator to the oil is going to bring uh, the reading uh, higher than 30 amps. And uh, in that case, that's uh, what we are going to report to the customer.